Hello, welcome back. Yet another episode of Let's Play Fez. Uh, at this point, I need to jump back in, I guess, and look for more, more fun times. Oh, I need to go up. I just need to continue my exploration around the map and get more cubes. Which I have plenty of places left to go. I didn't really touch very much. Uh, I will admit, I've had some computer hardware issues this week, and so it's been a little bit of time between that recording and this one. Uh, which is why I have to push all the buttons again to make sure I remember how to do stuff. Here we go, here's the map. Here's what I wanted. So from here, the, the bell tower is the only place I have been, um, and everywhere else is new. So I just need to make sure not to go to that same bell tower again, and guaranteed new content. So how about the lighthouse? Jump on in. Alright, so what do we have here? At least one bit up above me. Spin a little bit. See what's going on. Oh, the music just cut out. A new music. Okay, a ladder is, I think, just so I can get out of the water. There doesn't seem to be anything down there. I can get enough height to go up there and get that piece. Hmm. Kind of a weird obelisk. But I can't really do anything with it. I can't even... Aha. Uh, all in due time. All the puzzles will make sense eventually. You can do it, Gomez! Do I have a key? Oh, I do. Let's not go in there yet. I'll go back to there. I want to go up here. Oh, right, but I can't, because I need to climb first. Which is probably... Yeah. We can spin it so this tree is near that island. Alright. Now we can go in this locked door, see what's up here. And, is it another key? Ooh, another map piece. Mysterious. Alright. Jump! And, one more mysterious metal door. We got six cubes so far, let's see if we can bolster that number quite a bit. Oh, this place is kind of neat. Um, here it is. this door. Oh, top of the lighthouse. What a deal. Anything on this island? Another door to a mysterious place. And I was already able to get to that bottom segment, so I don't need to go back there. Should be the end of my adventure here. Oh, interesting. Okay, so we have this tube on a rotator base. Okay. And we have this tower in the background that I can't easily get to, but I can go through the tube. So maybe I can get inside it now. Okay, so now I can climb up this. Aha, I see what we're doing. Spin it around. How can I get it so I'm standing on the tube? That looks pretty far to jump. And dead. They share, okay, so they share the same outline, so there isn't anything I can stand on that is a member of both. Uh, I gotta be missing something. Just go straight to the top? No, because this tree's slightly too tall. Oh, here we go. There, just stand here. There, now I'm on the tube. Mm -hmm. 
and to the top of the tower. Now, why am I coming up here? What was up here? Just this door. In we go. Adventure awaits. And another like sewers puzzle. Oh, lots of rotating bits this time. What actually rotates when I spin this? Okay, just this segment. Line up with this ladder. Continue up. But all this work for one bit? That seems like too little. Sign. Oh, I've done. Okay, so alphabet stuff I haven't learned yet. Yep, no idea how to read that. Place is not clear. It has a chest somewhere. Maybe it'll be in here. Oh, maybe the bottom sign's for a treasure chest. Oh, nope. I'm loading between regions now. Well, so much for that place. Now we're in this place. Oh, it probably means we're not too far from a portal that will take us back. And we get the fun of these uh, new rotating platforms. So, no complaints here. I do kind of like the... Uh, just explore around, run around and find stuff. Um, the world has plenty of surprises everywhere. They figure out how to how to climb anywhere. I guess I use spinning platforms right off the bat. Whoa. Okay, was there anything over here I wanted to see? Door. Are we ready for doors yet? What's in here? Oh, portal's in this place. Oh, that's that frame at the top. Yeah, several doors. So we can have plenty of fun exploring those. But first... I activate that portal just to make sure we can get back here if I need three doors confirmed. I mean, I guess the map obviously like makes it very clear how many doors are actually here. Yes, you found another warp gate. Now connects to every other warp gate you found so far. Pick a desti destination and press up to warp. So I only see the blue skies one. Yeah. Okay, I'm really just going through so I can come back through and make sure that it all worked. This is the first warp gate I've actually used so far. Yeah, it's a green place. I was in the green skies area. And map-wise, tons of stuff still here to do, but the new region just seems more exciting. So, I'll go back there. There'll be plenty of time to clear stuff out later. Sip a little coffee during the loading screens. Coffee makes video games happen. So, we're back. One door at a time. There was a door right over here, correct? Why not? The map actually makes it seem like there might be five doors here. But it's definitely a door. Let's figure out which one it was. You can see another place in the background. Yeah, so there's two more doors from here, and one of which is locked. Uh, interesting. Whoa. One more. So here's the locked door. I don't remember. Do I have a key? I do have a key. So we could just go in there. Even though there's a warning sign. Okay, before continuing, let's go in the locked door. Shadows in the background, this goes to even more regions. Oh, there's nothing here. It just connects to, whoa, connects through to down there. That is nuts. Oh, because it's the door I came through. Where am I actually going? Oh, sewer pipe. Oh, that's kind of neat how the chain connects. So I, oh man. Okay, let's go through here, get to the sewer area, play some Mario for a little bit, 
and see if there's another portal device in here. This is definitely a region boundary. I didn't mean to beeline straight for the, the region. No, that's exactly what I did. Uh... Ah, uh, there we go. Somewhere there's a bit. There we go. And a door. Welcome to Sewer's World. Man, the colors here are so, like, it's dark. Okay, I'm gonna go through there. I'm gonna try to collect the bits in this room and then go through the portal back to the green skies region. Floating platform up here. Yeah, and there's plenty of places to explore here, but really just interested in getting my bits and going back to that last place because I, I didn't even touch anything. But, oh, I wasn't paying attention. Welcome to the cube. One more cube. And green skies. So it seems like there's only, I mean, what, five portals? Because you can only ever see four other ones at a time. Yeah, sewer portal right there. So I'm starting to hack those out, even though I'm not clearing segments. Random door. It's a room filled with black holes. And a door, an affinity door that doesn't, does not want to open for me yet. Okay. The secret of the infinity doors will come in time. I bet. Nope, it says that room's finished. I was willing to bet that there was some sort of secret buried in that room. Because the infinity door. It might just be for convenience though, getting around later. Okay, I already went in that door. Where was this other door? There's that one's the one I came in. There we go, that door. Now where's Gomez? Oops. Oh, let's go in this one right here. Since I'm already here. These zones change for, like, chained together for so far. Oh, jeez, the spinning. Okay, here. Whoa. But even if you don't know where you're going, you can just... Step on one of these and wait for it to spin until you can see the jump you can take. So I guess I'm using launch platforms from here. Yeah, that'll work. Whoa, shoot! Okay, not yet. Jump to the right. That'll work. Okay, so now I need to catch this jump and need to go here. Not bad at all. I guess I have to drop down to get this bit. Keep climbing up. This is very tall. Uh, how do I line those up? There we go. No! Gomez, no! Ah. 
Okay, patience, patience. Okay, okay. Here we go again. Am I missing things on the way up? I haven't seen any of the little pings of like nearby bits. So I think I'm doing well. Okay. That's kind of cool. That's a cool effect. Really easy puzzle though. Yeah. It's very yellow up here. It's getting a little tough to see. Treasure chest. All right, I'm betting key. Is it a key? Is it a key? Treasure chest? Treasure map, right. Let's take a look at those treasure maps real quick, as soon as I can figure out the button for it. Here we go. So this first one, solid map, there's a, a secret something in there. I haven't seen any place that looks like this yet. This one... Well, it looks like a full map view, it looks like a standard map. Oh, there's two platforms there. Cool. This one. Is that infinity sign down on the bottom left? Okay. So at the top of... This looks actually like a screw thing, like in the current level I'm in. I think at the top there are alternating platforms, but you can only... They're only on one side. Not this place, is it? Maybe it's that next screw section. Right, I need to rotate it like this, I guess. Going up. This is screwed up. <laughs> oh, I'm so funny. Okay. Not funny at all. I feel like I've been in this zone for a very long time. This, uh, one level. And we made it to the top where there's a door, and that's it. Nothing else here. Really, if you look at it, yeah, nothing here except a door. Next zone, here we come. Ah, uh, one more zone. Okay, we'll end this one. This one seems to have a portal near the top. Quick, quick. Oh, an entire cube piece, all for me. A full cube. Ta-da! I like it when they give me full cubes. So I'm at eight. Back to that place with all the doors. Well, I'll go through this portal, see where it takes me. And everything else is gonna have to wait for next episode. So I'm ending this episode here. Um, tune in for episode four to figure out what's in the eight cube door. Thanks.